Did you know that some pigments and dyes have also been used as medicines? Prussian blue is an iron cyanide pigment invented in the 18th century. It's the blue in Hokusai's The Great Wave of Kanagawa, one of the most reproduced artworks in history. But Prussian blue is also used as an antidote to certain types of heavy metal and radiation poisoning. Saffron is a spice derived from a species of crocus. It's been highly valued for thousands of years for both its flavour and the bright yellow dye it produces. It was widely used in Persian manuscript illumination, but it also has a very long history as an anti-inflammatory and antiseptic medicine. Alexander the Great supposedly bathed in infusions of saffron while on military campaign. While some dyes and pigments have been used directly as medicines, others can be used in medical technology. Egyptian blue was a synthetic copper calcium silicate pigment first produced over 5,000 years ago. It can be found across ancient Egyptian wall painting, sculpture, and other ritual and everyday objects. The amazing thing about Egyptian blue is that it fluoresces near infrared light. Very few materials do this, and it could be harnessed to improve the quality of medical imaging. So even a very ancient pigment can find cutting edge applications in the medical field.